Hey everyone! In this video, we are going to learn how you can send WhatsApp messages to newly created HubSpot records automatically. As we know, there is no direct connection between HubSpot and WhatsApp. We are going to integrate both of them with the help of an integration software that is Public Connect. So that whenever a new record or contact is added in HubSpot, Public Connect will automatically send the message directly on WhatsApp to that new record or contact. And you know what the best part is? This process requires no coding knowledge. And any non-technical person can also do this easily. So let's begin with the process. Okay, so this is my HubSpot account and here I'm going to create a contact. Contact could be anything, lead, subscriber, customer, anything. It could be anything. Okay, so here I'm going to create a contact and this is my WhatsApp. This is the WhatsApp of that particular subscriber or the contact who will receive the message. Okay, about the creation of record or contact. That's how it is going to work. And here I am using chat API for the integration of WhatsApp and to send message on WhatsApp. Now, three more important thing about chat API is that it is a paid software and Public Connect doesn't own it. So we are going to use it for sending WhatsApp messages. So to begin the process, let's type public.com in the browser. Okay, so here public.com wonderful now press enter okay so this is the site of pabli here you have to click on products and you have to click on connect okay and this is the landing page of pabli connect here you have to sign in as i have already created my account that's why i'm directly signing in you can also create your free account just in two minutes so sign in okay so this is my profile and here i'm going to click on connect access now Okay, that's how you will reach to the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Here you have to create the workflow. For this, you have to click on this create workflow button. Just click on it. And here you have to name your workflow. So my workflow name is HubSpot to WhatsApp. Here, let me just capitalize this S. Okay wonderful now it is correct okay so click on create and this is the name of your workflow okay so here I would like to mention that I will add the link of this workflow in the description box you can clone it and directly access it into your account okay so whenever you click on create these two windows will appear these two windows this window is known as trigger window and this window is known as action window this is a trigger and this is an action so you might be thinking what is this trigger or action. So let me tell you automation works on the concept of trigger and action. Trigger says when this happens and action says do this. Suppose in this use case whenever a new record is added in HubSpot this will be a trigger. Send messages to WhatsApp directly will be action of this process. Okay so that's how it is going to work. Now what we are going to do? First we are going to connect HubSpot with Pabli and then Pabli with Chat API to send WhatsApp messages. Okay, that's how it is going to work. And here I'm going to choose a trigger application. So trigger application is HubSpot. Okay. Okay, HubSpot CRM. Wonderful. And here you have to choose a trigger event. So trigger event is new contact added. Okay, so this one okay so this is the trigger event and here we have to connect our hubspot with pabli for that you have to just click on this connect button click here and here you have to mention the api key for that you have to follow these steps these particular steps and i'm going back to this hubspot account here i'm going to click on the settings okay and here scrolling it down and going to click on integrations and here api key okay and here api key will be visible this one okay so let me just show yes i'm not a robot and here copy wonderful now going back to public connect and here i'm going to paste it okay 
wonderful now clicking on save okay wonderful now we have successfully connected pably with hubspot now here i'm going to click on save and send test request before that i just want to make sure that you have created a new contact for in this video i'm going back to hubspot and creating a new contact okay then we will click on save and send test request okay going in the context section and contacts okay and here going to click on create contact okay here email is suppose ria24 at the rate gmail.com first name is ria and second name is Mishra okay and here okay contact owner that's it and here job title you can add as I adding it as professor okay and here phone number make sure you should add 91 before your phone number okay so yeah wonderful now here live cycle stage here you can add it as subscriber lead marketing qualified lead it's up to that customer or that particular record okay so i'm adding it as a subscriber okay and here lead status you have to add the lead status and i'm just adding it connected wonderful now here i'm going to click on create contact wonderful we have successfully created the contact okay so now going back to pably connects window and here going to click on save and send test request wonderful we have received the details and these details have a look okay email id name first name and uh, yeah going scrolling down okay the job title last name and life cycle stage okay everything is visible phone number and yeah everything is visible wonderful so here these details can be mapped in the down window okay in this action window how let me tell you okay so now we have successfully connected hubspot with pably we are going to connect next window action window or action application with pably so our action application is chat api here as i've already told you that chat api will help us to send the message and it is a paid software okay so here okay i'm going to add it as a send it message okay now click on connect okay and you api url okay for that you have to go back to chat api okay now this authentication status should be authenticated okay now i would like to mention here that the installation process the setup this is all given in the description box the whole process and the link is given in the description box so you have to click on the link and you will be able to set up the chat api account okay so here you are authenticated and i'm going to copy this api url okay going back to public connect here upi api url wonderful now the token thing so token going back again to chat api and this is the token just beside api url so click on this token and copy it yeah copy and pasting it in this token section wonderful now click on save and you have saved the credentials let me just tell you one more thing public connect is 100 percent safe you can use it and you can use it very freely it is 100 percent safe it doesn't take any chances with your data so yeah here you have to add the phone number and you have to add the message okay so these fields will be visible whenever you'll get connected to chat api with pably okay so wonderful here you have to add the phone number and the phone number is let me just map it i've already told you that our details can be mapped in the down window and i can just simply write the number here okay this is so here in the message i can write it as 
hello and here just a space and first name let me just scroll it down okay this is the first name and space and here last name let me just scroll it down okay 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 this is the last name wonderful Surya Mishra you are added as now the field that means life, life cycle stage that is as a subscriber okay this one okay now full stop okay so this is the common or this is just a general message to that contact whenever he will be added he or she will be added in hubspot okay so here we have added the details now i'm going to click on save and send test request okay so the response is received that means the message has been sent through chat api to whatsapp okay so now going back to this whatsapp thing and uh, checking there let me just tell you one more thing hubspot may require or may add some time to the response so don't worry about it and don't panic you can receive your response might be two minutes later might be three minutes later or sometimes in just few seconds so this is how it works so going back to this whatsapp and checking whether he or she received the message or not that means Ria mishra has received the message or not okay so hello Ria mishra you are added as subscriber okay this is a space thing we can correct it in that section only so yeah here in the public connect you can just add a space here over here you can space add space this kind of space and you can add this text or message according to yourself you have to take care about the space you have to take care about the full stops and if you want to add a next line you can add as slash n over here okay so yeah a bit of space and slash n if you want to make it as to next line okay let me just show you how it will be as our result okay so how it will come as a message after adding this slash n let me just go back to whatsapp before that just click on this save and send test request okay this is again sent and going back to whatsapp just to check whether we received this next line message or not okay so going back to whatsapp okay so this is how we got the second message that is hello Ria Mishra you are added as subscriber here we have added next line and we have added some kind of space okay so now going back to public connect and here I'm going to minimize all the windows and will be summarizing what we have done basically okay so here okay so what we have done in this video we have first connected hubspot with pabli and then pabli with chat api, chat api to send whatsapp messages that's how we have built a connection between these two applications so one more thing i would like to mention that the link as i've already mentioned that the link of this workflow will be in the description box so i hope you really found the video helpful and if you have any queries please visit pabli.com that .com and our team will definitely help you there you can create your free account just in two minutes so thank you for watching and if you really like the video please like share and subscribe the channel thank you